Hey everyone, welcome back to App Unbox. Today we have something really exciting to share with you. We recently came across a fantastic tool called Sessions, and we've been dying to tell you all about it. If you're looking to unlock your full potential and boost your productivity, this product might just be the one for you. So let's dive in. All right, so here it's Sessions, and we're gonna scroll down. The website feels a little laggy, maybe because of my specs. All right, so it's trusted by Canva, Zapier, Airtable, Typeform, Solar Dexo, and a lot more. Then we have create remarkable experiences with none of the added stress. Then we have product demos and launches, customer engaging webinars, uh, tough leadership webinars, customer success and onboarding workshop, experience uh, measurable improvements in audience engagement and a lot more but uh, before and uh, we are going to check out the pricing but uh, let's start by talking about what sessions is all about sessions is a powerful productivity tool designed to help you manage your time effectively and stay focused on your tasks with its sleek and intuitive interface it promises to make your work days more organized and stress-free so let's check out the pricing of sessions. Here we go on the pricing page. So here, create one account and give everyone in your organization access. How many max attendee, attendees do you uh, need per session? So we can, uh, can manage our attendees. So we can take up to 1000. Wow, that's pretty cool. Uh, so if you want 30 or less, then it's probably better to have the free plan and a zero dollar no credit no credit card is required you can add up to 90 minutes per session up to 30 participants per session and unlimited sessions and rooms full access for five team members one event per month and as you can see we have the pro package we where we will be getting a free trial and if you pay annually then it will be uh, you will be saving 20 percent if you're paying annually but uh, the the monthly subscription fee is quite a lot as you can see it's 124 dollars now let's go ahead and check out sessions lifetime deal so we have uh, sessions on app sumo and we have on deal mango lifetime deal hunt they just redirects none of these are legit so we are going to close it and stick with AppSumo we have $49 a deal okay so we're not even paying a half of the monthly fee we're just paying $49 so what are we getting in $49 let's go and check out it's best for customer support marketeers sales managers and alternative to Google Meet Microsoft Teams or Zoom now let's just scroll down so here is the deals, uh, deal term and conditions. Lifetime access to sessions, all future pro or business plan updates. If plan name changes, deal will be mapped to the new plan name with all accompanying updates. No codes, no stacking, just choose the plan that's right for you. You must activate your license within 60 days of purchase. Okay, so these are the uh, deals and con deal terms and conditions. And then we have the features unlimited sessions 25 speakers on screen and here is the license tier one all the features above uh, 15 team member accounts 45 participants per sessions three hour per sessions 90 days memory and then we have the license tier two so let's see which uh, which one matches with the license tier one 15 team member team member accounts 45 participants so 45 participants so i think this License tier one is something between this uh, free and pro plan. As you can see, this one has up to, to 100, 200, or 500 participants. And here is 90 participants, uh, 150 participants. All right, so yeah, that's quite expensive. Uh, $124 per month. You're not just paying $124 per month for nothing. We are getting AI Copilot here. Now, let's see if we get AI Copilot. Yeah, AI Copilot starts with two codes. So the two code version which is $99 uh, a lifetime lifetime purchase will be at same almost at same as this one only you'll just be getting some less participants 90 uh, participants per session where you will get 100 here minimum so let's uh, see what the tier 2 3 gives us uh, 150 participants and we can stack the code up to five times 
uh, tier four will give us 300 participants, which is uh, almost same as the pro one. And then we have tier five participant, I mean tier five code, which is uh, almost $200 more, $300 more, okay. So we are jumping right from 300 participants to 1000 participants, which is almost, well, something between pro and business. Well, not 300, 3000. Uh, business is providing us 3000. So the package that Sessions is providing is very much different from the package that uh, coming with AppSumo lifetime deal. So if you need AI Copilot and need more participants per session, then I will say that you should get the Legends tier 2. Otherwise, the Legends tier 1 will do the trick, or you can also go with the free if you just need 30 participants. So we're going to sign up for free. All right, so we have one click login with Google. We are going to click on continue with Google. All right, let's set you in. We are here and our sign up is almost complete. We're clicking on continue. And here we have sessions. So how are you planning to use sessions for myself? Mm, so here I'm planning to use sessions for my team or for myself. Yeah, I'm going to use it for myself. Uh, I'm going to select the industry. Well, which is going to be marketing and then I'm going to select my role. I'm going to select team member. So what am I trying to do in sessions? Well, we're training demos especially and team meetings. So I've selected three options and then I'll click on continue. So finally, a meeting and webinar platform that reflects your professionalism. Let's see. Sessions is a platform for standout workshoppers, webinars, demos, and lots more. Okay, so we have the entire user interface of the sessions here. Let's take a uh, take a look at and let's take a look at a glance and get a quick overview about it. Now over here we can set up our workspace. We can give feedback. We have uh, planning. I guess this is the schedule planning section. See sessions in action. Team hosts. Yeah. We are definitely going to be planning sessions uh, here. All right, so how do I get back from here? Okay, cancel. Here we go. Then we have create. We can start a session right away, schedule a session for later, create events, uh, a lot more. We have homepage, we have memory, calendar, we have book booking uh, models, book me, uh, events, rooms. And here are some resources like agendas, files, tools, and a free special trial. So we're going to go to account now. We have account settings, contacts, uh, release notes, and we have joining our community. We can have, we have health center and I guess that's it. So let's get started by uh, creating a session. So we are creating a session right away. Uh, let's uh, use our camera and, and microphone. Okay, let's give them access. All right, so here is our session. We can insert our name and no, we can't change our name, it's uh, fixed. And we have settings here. We have our, we can select our microphone and we're gonna be selecting, yeah, system default microphone, system default speakers, and then we have instant sessions. So we're gonna click on join now. And here we go, we are in a session. Close and don't show again. Find in memory once the session is over. So this session will be found in memory once it's over. And since um, when I'm talking and moving my hand, the disk is shaking and the laptop uh, camera is also shaking as you can see. So add an interactive agenda, start a transcript. So uh, I, uh, how would I be able to invite people to sh this session? Here we go, we have participants copy session link so here is the copy session link you're going to be able to you're going to be able to share this link with people and uh, invite them to join in so we can also invite participants from here synchronizing email all right that's enough let's close it the session is unlocked all right we're going to end the session okay leave the session there we go go to home now let's check out the memory and uh, see if we can find our sessions here. Easily access your past sessions. All right. Memory, total sessions, seven. Learn more. Well, 
well uh, since no one was in my session the session memory is not saved yet but if people are joining your session and it's a successful session well my one of it's just a test run then your session will appear here and you will be able to check them out so let's get back to home and then we're going to now schedule a session now this is going to be test run okay now we are going to set date and time so date will be tomorrow the time will be yeah 12 p.m is nice so the session will be for two hours 12 1 and 2 sometimes it takes much but no problem okay so we can, it can be more than one day look it's wednesday i guess 2 to 2 p.m wednesday 2 okay so we can change the date to uh, august 3 and it will be like you know, more than 24 hours okay it's gonna be 26 hours no we don't want that much long session then we are gonna select our time zone well the time zone is okay so we are not uh, touching it anymore then we have repeat does the session repeat daily weekly or monthly we can set it if the session repeats uh, weekly we can select weekly if it's an everyday thing we select daily and if it's a monthly thing we select monthly then repeat every month we have selected month every month on the second third or we can select the date so this will repeat every month on the 15th this will um, end okay this will end after yeah so this will end after we can select this will end after six occurrences or on we can select date when will it end so uh, it's better to select after occurrences so it will end after six occurrences and then we have participants so we can select the participants we are inviting one guest then we can invite another guest too so here are our guest list then we have uh, selected our participants we're going to select session agenda but i'm pretty sure that we haven't created any agenda yet so we are unable to select that and then we're going to go to session settings reactions everyone screen sharing everyone allow camera for everyone allow microphone for everyone then hide interactive participants well we will not allow camera for everyone the camera is only available for speakers and hosts and then we have X, uh, well, hide inactive participants don't show participants whose microphones and cameras are off okay but uh, we don't want to hide inactive participants because we want to see everyone who are in the session then we have automatic recording automatically start recording when the session uh, goes live then uh, we have automatic transcribing automatically start the transcript when the session goes live okay we can start on automatic recording then we have access settings we can lock the session approve each attendee before they can join request guest email we have memory access one attendee moderator now memory access moderators only attendees or anyone with the link so we're gonna give it uh, memory access to anyone with the link okay then we can request to guest gmail a uh, guest email if someone without a session account wants to join they will have to provide their email address well they will not have to provide their email address if one is free to join view agenda well everyone will be able to everyone will be able to view agenda now we are going to schedule the session and the session have been scheduled popped one participant well the others did not accept that's why uh, we have only one participant here let's get back to home page so guys we have checked out start session and scheduling a session now we are going to create an event so event name is going to be test event then we are going to select a date for it it's going to be 4th of august then 12 12 to 1 all right so it's 13 then event invite event collaborators so we are going to invite invite event collaborators one collaborator invited only member of the workshop workspace can be added to team to be team member right it all right so no uh, we, can, we can only add member of the work uh, workspace 
the to be team members but there is no one else but me in my workspace so i will not be able to invite any event collaborators now so we're just going to create the event like this all right so here it is just event and we have our event name we'll just type down some description then we have starting and ending date we have time zone then we have speakers add some speakers to your event we can add uh, speakers to our event, new speaker, add collaborators, add speakers. No, we are not adding anyone. We, we haven't set any agenda yet or else we would be able to add agenda here. Then we have advanced settings. What kind of event is this? Well, it's a workshop event, webinar event or what. So it's a workshop event. We can lock the session, approve each attendee before they can join. Well, the session will not be locked, okay? But still, it's a workshop. The workshop events have to be locked what kind of well since we want unlocked session we can select custom then we have request guest gmail reactions screen sharing everyone no screen sharing only speakers and hosts we have i'll be allowing cameras for speakers and hosts too then view agenda everyone hide inactive well automatic recording turned on it's the same as a session i mean scheduling sessions then we have extras which is registration test event registration form all right so we have a registration form here where we can preview the form let's see first name last name and email then register now so people can register using this form then we have the landing page we'll go image banner image so we can set all of our social media uh, urls here then uh, we will be able to view the participants who have uh, join here through the registration form and after that in participants will be able to view those people who are uh, going to be able to register and, and become our participants now let's go ahead and publish the event now the event have been published let's go to home all right now let's go ahead and go to calendars and here we go at 2 p.m friday our event have been set so you'll be able to find the event in calendar so guys, as you can see, you are, you are able to do so much using sessions. Uh, you can manage your workshop, webinar, and manage lots of online sessions, even with the free account. So after using free account, if you get used to it, and you feel like that you need more, then you can go for the premium plan. Well, thanks for joining us today. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. If you've already tried sessions, let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, stay productive and keep chasing your dreams. Take care.